All right, hello, hello. Welcome to a new video. Basically, we are at the accommodation cup. Accommodation cup is basically all student accommodations against each other. So as you can see, the vibe here is spectacular. We have about seven student accommodations: Escape, Switch, Dwell, Uni Lodge, um, University of Adelaide Village. Um, y Suites, you go. Yeah. Oh, I got all seven. Now, before I tell you all about the accommodation cup, let me talk to you a little bit about student accommodations because a bunch of you have questions regarding the same. When I came to Adelaide, I was under the impression that you know what, I'll get a private accommodation, I'll get a private room, I'll get a lease. But that's not how the real picture looks like. To get a room, to get a lease under your name, you need to have credit history, you need to have pay slips, you need to have a bunch of references which a new international student like you wouldn't have. So that is where Amber Student comes in. Amber Student is a platform through which students can book their student accommodations hassle-free. So there's no going to each and every student accommodations websites and comparing prices because Amber has it all. So essentially, it's a one-stop shop for student accommodations. You name it, they have it. So literally, everything is the same, no extra price, and you get certain advantages such as no hassle, convenience, uh, post accommodation services, expert advice, and comparison. They have a 4.8 rating out of 5 and they are available in a bunch of cities including Melbourne, Sydney, Gold Coast, Adelaide and many more. So what are you waiting for? To book your student accommodation, click the first link in the description and if you book your accommodation through that link, it will help me and support me as well. Thank you. But yeah, we have 7 student accommodations here with us and what they are doing right now is this started at 10am 10, 10 and this will they're doing like a come and try session so they're trying eat all a lot of sports so cricket frisbee uh disc golf handball uh lawn tennis soccer and a couple of other sports as well so they're trying everything out at 12 there's lunch and then there's the competitive match but yeah as you can see cricket going on over there uh study adelaide over here now oh. I'm here to tell you all about the accommodation cup and what the structure was like, kya kya ho raha tha, kya kya nahi ho raha tha. Um, I've been wanting to particularly shoot this clip. Um, I've been particularly wanting to shoot this clip at a ground, like bahar jaake ground mein, kyunki sports ke baare mein, like it's all about sports. But uh, weather itna ganda hai, like the weather has been so shit. So what the accommodation cup is all about is basically one accommodation versus one accommodation versus another accommodation like you just saw amber amber student as well so check out the link if you want to book your student accommodation it'll help me as well and it gives you other support but anyways um accommodation cup has been going on for a some amount of years now um but uh, covid ke beach mein it stopped because there couldn't be any large gatherings so what is happening in this accommodation cup this was organized by study adelaide as i told you now, Study Adelaide is the body that does a lot of free events, uh, career, job prospects, everything. They do everything. So get connected with them. Now, so Study Adelaide brought it back this year after COVID and they restarted everything. They reached out to all student accommodations, Scape, Uni Lodge, Dwell, Yugo, um, University of Adelaide Village. I think one or two or another I'm missing. Switch, the switch. So first what happened was that Study Adelaide partnered up with another sporting organization and we saw their representatives talk about what they're doing, what the accommodation cup will look like and on a teams mein baata. Now how were these teams uh, segregated? Rock, paper, scissors. Yes, it's, as, it's that's the thing. They wanted to make it so easily accessible to everybody. If you not cricket, you could have come and played. If you didn't soccer or tennis, nahi khela, it's very easy. They made it very easy. So that was one great thing. Another good thing was that we saw representatives from I think 10 different countries. Not representatives but students, sorry. So India, UK, Australia, Canada, China, Pakistan, um, yeah, Afghanistan, Bangladesh. So our students, different different uh, universities, say, accommodations, say, different different um, countries. Say. So how it worked was that all the people came in together 
now they were divided into teams i think teams of eight and then they were uh, come and try sessions so basically abhi kuch competition aspect shuru nahi hota there, there was no competition aspect at the first where you were just trying out different sports you were trying out how to play different sports agar aapko cricket khelna aata hai to aap cricket khelo but uske baad you move on to another sport um where for example if you don't know that to aapko sikhate hain wo and it's just for an hour or so where you come and try different sports then after trying sports like cricket frisbee disc golf soccer uh, lawn tennis uh, we came and had lunch all together and again lunch drinks everything was organized by study adlet after lunch all teams were pitted against each other and then there was a winner and at the end um like it was it got very cut throat it was very competitive bahut zyada competition ho gaya tha and yes i think team b won if i'm not wrong and um so different accommodations ke log the har team mein so you could talk to different people you could talk to different guys you could talk to different girls and then everybody was playing together so everybody made a lot of good friends as well so yes that was what that was the accommodation cup for this year um again more videos coming your way because february may a lot of you are coming and i have some good news as well which i'll be sharing in the next some some of the videos i got a full time job so that's great so if you have any questions with jobs accommodations uh, feel free to reach out in the comments um, instagram anywhere happy to help you out that's what this channel is all about so like share subscribe <laughs>